Welcome, everyone. Today, we are embarking on a very exciting journey. Exploring the entire process of growing mulberry trees. From planting these beautiful mulberry trees, carefully nurturing them, to harvesting the fruit, and finally, processing the mulberries into various products. We will explore everything step by step. Whether you're interested in the cultivation process, or simply captivated by mulberry trees, this documentary will guide you through each step of the journey. Just sit back and relax. Get ready to explore together the fascinating world of mulberry trees. Mulberry trees thrive in temperate regions and require specific soil conditions. Farmers usually plant mulberries in early spring or late autumn, as the weather during these seasons is mild, helping the mulberry roots firmly established in the soil before the scorching summer or freezing winter arrives. There are two main methods of propagating mulberry trees. One is growing from seeds and the other is cutting propagation. If you want to grow mulberries on a small scale at home, you can use the seed propagation method. You need to collect seeds from fully ripened mulberries. However, this process is quite time consuming as seedlings grow slowly and may not retain the desirable traits of the parent tree. Once the seeds germinate and the seedlings reach a suitable height, further care can be continued. Cutting propagation is a more effective method for large-scale cultivation. Farmers select healthy branches from parent trees for propagation. This method ensures that the new plants inherit the desirable traits of the parent tree. After planting the mulberry trees, regular care is required. Because no matter what you grow, careful maintenance is essential. Water is the most important factor, especially in the early stages of mulberry tree growth. Farmers usually keep the soil moist. They water the plants regularly, directly at the roots.
pruning is also an essential part of keeping mulberry trees healthy. Removing withered branches. Not only helps the tree grow better, but also stimulates it to produce more fruit. Besides pruning, farmers also need to fertilize and control pests. All these factors must be well balanced. As a result, the mulberry tree grows healthily and produces more fruit. After months of careful nurturing, the mulberry tree finally starts bearing fruit. Typically, mulberries ripen in late spring or early summer. However, the exact timing depends on the variety. Mulberries come in colors ranging from white to deep purple. When the fruit becomes juicy and slightly soft to the touch, it is ready for harvest. Harvesting mulberries requires great care. It must be done gently, as the berries are very soft and easily bruised. Many farmers use traditional harvesting methods. They spread a cloth under the tree, then gently shake the branches. The ripe berries naturally fall, while the unripe ones remain on the tree to continue ripening. This method not only protects the mulberry tree, but also makes harvesting more efficient. After harvesting, mulberries need to be processed immediately because they are highly perishable and can spoil within just a few days. Farmers usually have two main options. Either selling fresh mulberries directly at the market or processing them into various products such as jam, mulberry wine, or dried mulberries. Speaking of processing, we can see how versatile mulberries can be. Fresh mulberries can be eaten as a snack. But besides that, they can also be turned into many other products such as mulberry jam, mulberry wine, and dried mulberries.
Mulberry jam is one of the most popular products made from mulberries. After washing the mulberries, they are placed in a pot for cooking. Add sugar and simmer. Cook slowly to soften the mulberries. Eventually, it will turn into a smooth and thick mulberry jam. During the cooking process, it is important to stir frequently to prevent burning and ensure that the sugar is fully dissolved. When the jam reaches the desired consistency, let it cool. Then store it in airtight jars for preservation. Mulberry jam is not only delicious, but also retains the nutritional value of the mulberries. It pairs perfectly with bread or pastries, making it a great choice for breakfast. So, our journey of discovery, from cultivation to harvest, and finally to processing, comes to an end here. We hope this video helps everyone gain a more interesting perspective on this unique cultivation process and understand it better. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends, and leave a comment below with your thoughts. Thank you all for watching. See you in the next video.